A one-year-old boy has miraculously survived being hit by a train when his stroller rolled off a railway platform in Melbourne. He suffered only cuts and bruises as the train driver hit the emergency brake. The timing could not have been more horrific. The stroller lurches forward just as a train pulls into Taronga Station in Melbourne's inner east. It topples down. The boy's grandmother lunges after him, but it's too late. The driver had applied emergency brakes well before the toddler fell into his path. His quick thinking might have saved the boy's life. With his traumatised three-year-old brother watching, paramedics worked on him in an ambulance. They cut off his clothing, fearing the injuries would have to be bad. His grandmother barely had the energy to speak. Is everyone OK? Uh, I hope so. The stroller slid face down for only five or six metres. The toddler injured his head. The face was blood. The face was blood. Otherwise, he was fine. I'm just concerned about the child, of course. That's my main concern. It's just the most miraculous circumstances that he's as uninjured as he is. The driver, however, was shaken. The train driver said to me, please make sure you put the brakes on your pram because I've just hit a hit a baby in a pram. Last October, only a couple of stations away, Wind pushed a six-month-old under a train. He also suffered little more than a cut head, but the ending is not always a miraculous one. In Adelaide, three years ago, five-month-old baby Leo tumbled into the Torrens River while his mother was distracted. The brakes on his pram were off. He couldn't be saved. It happens so easily. Robert Ovadia, 7 News.